Hello everybody, welcome back to BeFit. I have a surprise for you. As I said, we're gonna show you different type of workout today. I'm gonna show you some home workout for some people, they cannot go to the gym for any reason. So be ready, we are going to start very soon. I'm so excited, I hope you are the same. So all we need is a mat and a chair. Very easy, very simple. But before we start, I want you to start with the very easy warm up. What I'm going to do, I'm going with the march it up for 20 seconds. Good job. Keep going, control your breath. I want to Bring it up, your heart rate, slowly, slowly. And it can be a very good program or workout for the basic people. They want to start the workout. Good job. Three, two, and one. And I start with the high knee for 20 seconds. Nice. Please lift it up your knee, not your hands down. Your hands is exactly in front of your chest. You just lift it up your knee and touch your hands. Three, two, and one. We are going for the butt kick. Sorry. From the back, 20 seconds. Nice and controlled. Good job. I feel my heart rate right now. Whew. Three, two, and one. Doing some squat. Good job. 20 seconds. Good job. Don't let your knee go forward. Three, two, and one. I'm going to warm it up. My upper body, which is gonna be good morning. 20 seconds, move your butt back. Don't care of your back. Nice and controlled. Good job. Five. Four, three, two, and one. Open your chest. Some warm up on your chest. Good. Nice and controlled. Ten, nine, eight. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and roll your shoulder to the back for 20 seconds. <sighs> nice. Five, four, three, two, and one, now we are going to the, to the other side. Good. Good job, I can feel my shoulder right now. With very simple workout, it's burning right now. Five, four, three, two, and one. Start to turning your elbow to warm it up. Nice and controlled, don't lose it. Good. And the other side for 20 seconds more. Nice. Control your breath. And then switch to the other side.
and then I'm going to turn it to the different side. Good job. Five, four, three, two, and one. We're going to warm it up our neck. Nice and easy, don't push. All you need to do, you're moving your ear to your shoulder. That's it. Good job. Five, four, three, two, and one. So get ready, we are going to start very soon our home workout. So workout number one, it's gonna be the push-up on the chair. Workout number one, we are going to do push-up on the chair, which is very easy, more easier than the normal push-up. All you have to do, you sit on your knee in front of the chair, put your hands on the chair, exactly in front of your shoulder and lift it up your calves from the back start going down for 15 reps good job as i said don't let your elbow going out it's gonna be problem good job five Four, three, two, one, relax, 10 second rest, and continue this workout for two more runs. We are getting ready for workout number two. Workout number two is mountain climbers. Again, we are going to do it on the bench, which is very easy and useful. All I have to do, I grab the side of the chair or the bench. My hands are in front of my shoulder and I bring my knee one by one to my chest. Good job. Do it for 15 reps, three, right and left is counting one. Don't forget. Four, five, six, seven, I can feel my abs, eight, nine, ten, one, two, three, four, and five. I'm going to take rest 10 seconds and we start workout number three. Workout number three, I'm going to do knee up crunches. All I have to do, I put my legs and the chair and I'm coming closer as much as I can because I want to feel my abs. And then when I get this position, I hold my neck without moving my neck because I'm working on my abs, not my neck. And I start to going up as much as I can and then down. Please, when you are going up, Try to hold yourself for one second and then go down. We're going to do it. 15 reps. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Wow. One, two, three, 
four and five. I prefer to hold it up for 10 seconds because I want to feel my muscles. Five, four, three, two, one, and rest 10 seconds. Continue this workout for two more runs. Workout number four is bridge. My favorite workout, as you know, I put my feet on the chair and then I put my hands next to your body and I lift my butt up and then I go down slow, touch only my butt on the floor. And again, 15 reps, three, four, Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, five more, one, two, three, four, and five, hold it 10 seconds, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. I totally feel my hamstring. Very good. 10 second rest and do this workout for two more runs. Workout number five is bicycle crunch. All I want you to do for the basic people because most of the people doesn't know how to do it with their upper body. So I'm going to do it only with my legs, but all I have to do it, I lay down, lift it up my legs and keep it up my chest without moving my upper body. Hold my neck and I start moving my legs, which is working in your lower abs. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I just show you how I use my arms for five more. Three, four, and Five. We're going to take rest 10 seconds and continue this workout for two more runs. Last workout, workout number six is high to low plank. This workout is one of the body weight workout. All you have to do it you're going to take the position of plank this way and then you start to going up one by one, by one with your arms. You're going to do it for 15 reps. If you cannot, you stay on your knee on this position. prefer to do it the full one. Three, two, and one. 10 second rest and continue this workout for two more runs. Okay, another workout is finished. I hope you enjoy it. Please, 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 as I say every day, every time, like in, on Instagram, on social media, on the TV, don't give up. You have a home for sure. 
you have a family, you have your friends, you can do it as a group workout in your home, just do it. All you need is a mat. If you don't have a mat, you can use it, your carpet, or you can use a blanket, you can use your chair, you can use the bottle of water for, for uh, use instead of using the dumbbell. So all I want you to do it, don't give up. If you want to be fit, if you want to be in shape, use everywhere for doing your workout. Love you all, thank you for watching Be Fit, waiting for me. I have a lot of different surprises for you and bye till the next program. Hello, welcome back to another program of cartooning with Behnam. I'm Behnam Babazadeh. I'm animation director, animator, and also I'm illustrator of children's book. I'm here to help you learn drawing cartoons with easy shape. And in this program, I want to help you learn drawing Arab man and samurai. Are you ready to drawing Arab man and samurai? Yes? Okay, let's begin. Let's begin. For drawing Arab man, first, we should draw this for, look at this. I start my character with this far. Okay. Great. This is so easy for, for drawing. Next, I want to add half circle. Yes, this is half circle. Okay, now I want to Draw two triangle, two rectangle. Yes, one rectangle and another one. Great, it's good. Now it's time to erase extra lines we don't need these lines so we erase them okay yes for drawing his face we put a line here and for eyebrows we use this and for his eyes, great. His eyes detail, his nose, and yes. Now we put his mouth. Great. For drawing his hands we put a line here and we add another line for this side great now we draw this curved lines for his hands for drawing his legs his shoes I put this forms great now if you like you can add his 
dress is texture sometimes okay you can use red lines for this part of his texture look at this I prefer that use red lines for drawing this lines and this textures yes it's so easy we are drawing an arab mat okay now we complex our details with the slides I'm sure that you can learn so fast these characters just you should pay attention to my drawings and you should focus and you should see exactly okay for drawing his shoes if you like you can add this part okay okay I add this part and I paint inside it Now I put this slide for show the ground. Great. And if you want, you can show in the background some forms of Arabic code or Arabic space. Yes. If you like, you can show these lines okay look i want to show you i draw this man i draw this arab man with easy shapes look at this it's so easy if you attention to this character you can find a lot of easy shapes for creating this character you can see this form this is his head look at this this is a half circle and the you, you can see there two rectangles and here you can see this form for driving his shoes and his legs i draw this part and same one for another side and for his hand i draw curved lines and i put a little bit curved lines here and for his face i use g and i use again for his eyes half circle look at this and you can show also you can uh, draw some lines for show the background if you like if you can for drawing a building you can draw these easy lines for show the buildings okay i hope you like this character and if you are ready we want to start our another character another character that i want to draw for you is samurai okay let's draw it For drawing a samurai, I want to show you drawing a samurai. For drawing a samurai, we need a lot of half circle. A lot of half circle for his head, for his head, and for his uh, dress. Okay, are you ready? Let's draw it. Okay, for drawing a samurai, first I want to draw his big hat. Yes. this is I use this triangle for his hat yes I use this triangle for his head and I use this half circle for his head and look at this upside down half circles we have upside down half circles for his dress's detail. Next, I put this 
lines. Mm -hmm. Now I put small circle and I draw two small triangle. Okay, and next I continue to drawing his belt. Okay, now. We put this, great, okay. Now for drawing his legs, I use you. You just, you like umbrella. I use you and another you. Yes. For his legs, I use this triangles. And I draw this rectangles. Yes. I put two rectangle here. Okay. One. We add one little bit small line at the middle and next we put two another little bit smaller line for his another finger okay first we put a line at the middle and we put another lines I think two lines is enough and next we put his shoes texture okay now for drawing his hands same form, we use U again, and I put U again, a little bit different, and again I draw another triangle, next I put one circle and same triangle for here. I paint inside my triangle and next I put small circle for his hands and for his face for his face I put this line and this line his name is Higashimura yes Higashimura just like Japanese names okay Mr. Higashimura is here and I put a W here Look at this, this is W, okay? Now, I continue these lines and I make this. Now I put his small mouth and his mustache. Otosai! Yes, just like samurai man. Okay. Now I put some details for his hat. Great. Now I want to put this important part of his war tools. Yes, it's effects. It's sound effect of his war tools. Right. For drawing the ground, yes. Okay, let me show you my samurai man. This is Mr. Otose. Mr. Otese, we draw it with these shapes. For drawing Mr. Otese, I start my drawing with this triangle and next I add some half circle and another half circle for his dress details and I put V shapes for his legs and some triangle and I put inside it dark and I paint them and next I put his war tools and sometimes you can 
add some texture for his head. Okay, this is my samurai man. This is so easy way to drawing. It was so easy way to drawing samurai man. Okay, for drawing samurai man and a lot of characters that you that you think that they are hard, they are not hard. They are so easy. Just you must use easy shapes. Okay. Thanks for watching me and see you next time. Bye bye.